This is the new CS2 kilowatt case and we're gonna react to every single skin in it. Of course, you're gonna be getting the best opinions from a real CS2 skins enjoyer. So let us get into this, but first, check out today's sponsor. CSGO Luck is the fastest growing case opening site with an extensive selection of cases and a plethora of game modes like Crash, Towers, Roulette, Mines, Coin Flip, and Case Battle. And if you don't wanna bet your own money, there's daily free cases on the site and level up bonuses which if you use my code you can get three free cases and a 100% deposit bonus for up to 100 coins of course the site has various deposit and withdrawal options including skins and crypto so you can go to csgo luck by clicking the link in the description and use my code to get three free cases and a 100% deposit bonus and start opening some cases all right so first of all the case itself does look pretty interesting i don't know if they're gonna do this design for the rest of the cs2 cases that are to come but nobody really cares about that so let's get into the skins the first one is the hideout for the dual berettas and this looks like a generic blue skin honestly i don't think we'll see this in games and competitive nobody probably wants to use this personally i'm gonna forget this exists in about two days so next blue is the light box for the mac 10 and I gotta say this isn't as bad as the dual berettas we saw previously but we have seen a lot of skins that were qualified to be blue skins and they did look pretty good so this is pretty disappointing at this point next thing over here is the dark sigil the nova blue skin honestly for a nova skin i think this looks pretty good so i'll let this one slide and i do like the art on this one but next blue is the i'm not gonna i i'm not even i'm not even gonna attempt to pronounce this one but i guess it's supposed to be called disaster so we're gonna go with that yeah i feel like there's 200 skins that look exactly like this in the game i don't really care about this one next up is the tech 9 slag this looks like a worse version of the default tech 9 honestly what the hell is going on right now all right but the next blue is the motorized ump and it looks like they just went from zero to a hundred over here if we look at the difference between all of these blue skins and the ump that we just saw it's night and day difference this one looks insane i would definitely use this in game especially if it's super cheap because it's a blue skin which is gonna be of course but now back to the more bland mediocre blue skins we got the I res the XM skin, it looks pretty bland. I don't really like this one. Next up is the block 18. This is amazing. It doesn't look that crazy, but honestly, the idea is pretty funny, so I like this one. Next purple skin is the Edge Lord. It looks worse than a blue skin, honestly. What is this? But next purple is the hybrid. It looks like 500 other purples that exist in the game for the 5-7 already. But the next one is the Just Smile. This is just boring and sad and pathetic what is this come on man we have a sort of skin the analog input yeah this is this is okay i guess it doesn't look that bad but the next one is the black lotus we had seen this one in the workshop and i did review this a few weeks ago it wasn't one of my favorites but it does look good compared to all of the other skins that we just saw in this case especially it does look like a good skin that deserves to be in a case the next one is a zeus skin the olympus this looks very good actually Oof. okay this is the first skin that i'm actually like wow this looks good it's a pink skin for the zeus i'm not gonna lie i think zeus skins are gonna be super cheap because who's gonna use the zeus ever or maybe i might just eat my words in the future they might be like knife skins for some reason who who knows maybe they end up being collectibles for some people but the next one is the jawbreaker for the usp it looks pretty good but i prefer the cortex or the kill confirmed i don't know if we'll see this one that much but the first red skin in the list over here is the chrome cannon for the awp i guess when you move in game this is gonna be like an interesting finish that changes colors because it's got chrome in the name but from this picture right here i don't see anything that crazy yeah i hope it's more interesting in game next one is the ak inheritance this has to be the last red skin from what, from what I see on the side right here. I thought this was going to be the porcelain, but they called it the inheritance. Yeah, we've seen this one before, and it's one of the best skins that they could have added. I hoped to see the AWP version of this skin, but I'll take the AK gladly. 
to be honest. But now they've also added the Kukri knife in this case. The twin blade isn't in the game yet, but we've got the Kukri knife and we can see all of the finishes here. And that's pretty much it. That's the case. So to be honest, I'm pretty disappointed by how mid the blue, purple and pink skins were. So I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know your opinions in the comments down below and I'll see you tomorrow. Peace.